during the staff I started thinking about uh, thinking and taking care of how to take care of the waste materials, how we should reduce waste, produce less waste, waste and how we can use it and recycle it. These kind of ideas were generated through this workshop and we now started uh, segregating the waste uh, through the direction given by the HECA and then these segregated materials were sold to the recycle, recycled people and by now we have generated uh, 20,000 NC already. Environment is just like saying prayer for us. So this is a very big educative value for us and students, uh, you know, without cooperation of the student, this cannot be success. So students are doing, actually, in 90% of the students that themselves are doing this through the Green Club. Namgil Green Club is a club uh, formed by students and advisors and it was uh, first established in 1997 by our late teacher Van Lopsang Chimbilla and it is uh, one side of one wings of Namgil Higher Secondary School as in our school there are two clubs uh, organized by the uh, advisor teachers and we have got uh, two groups uh, one is Namgil Green Club uh, which is an environmental group and second, we have got Namgil Student Council, which helps the in inter interaction between students and teachers. This state students learn to respect, to some extent, they learn to respect ways. You know, and they make fun of us, like, you know, if they throw something that is recyclable and, uh, uh, you are throwing money, something like that, because they know that now we are earning money from that ways, you no. Know? The zero waste management was quite tough, was a little bit difficult at the beginning, but now being more conscious and more awareness, being more regarding the waste, uh, zero waste management in our school, it's quite easy because it, uh, it not only helps in changing the behavior of an individual, it helps to keep the whole environment clean the burning of 80% of waste stages are <coughs> reduced by segregating the waste. <coughs>